If you think of Airbnb and Lyft as social media companies because of the peer-to-peer -peer nature, then peer-to-peer -peer technologies of all sorts could be a potential next wave in tech. That includes, of course, the blockchain. For more insight on that, Reggie Middleton is on the show. He's the founder of peer-to-peer -peer company Veritasium. Ed first asked for his thoughts on where the blockchain technology is right now, and here is what he had to say. Well, first of all, I'd like to get this out. I think blockchain technology and Bitcoin itself is probably the most misunderstood technology um, or popular wave um, that I know of. Um, a lot of people eschew Bitcoin because of what they read in the media, and they should you know, realize, with all due respect to Boom Bust, which is, of course, a stand-up uh, media outlet or entity, but the media does not necessarily report on empirical fact, they attempt to sell impressions and eyeballs. So when they read something, they take it as fact. Um, the Bitcoin network is still going, is as strong as it ever was. Um, uh, computational hash power, basically the security behind it, is now 30% higher than it was historically ever, and it's still progressing. Uh, a blockchain technology, which is the technology that underlies the Bitcoin network, is getting a lot of attention and a lot of money, but most of that attention and most of that money is going in the wrong direction. It's going to basically bolster the back end of legacy bank systems. Um, blockchain technology is a peer-to-peer -peer technology. Basically, the invention is the paradigm shift, the aha moment for blockchain technology and Bitcoin is to enable Peter to do business with Paul when Paul is on the other side of the world and Peter doesn't know Paul and Paul doesn't know Peter. They can exchange value and they can do business with each other without the risk of loss or fraud or without each one taking or cheating the other one. That is an invention that just didn't, or a possibility that didn't exist before. This is done peer-to-peer -peer, and most importantly, this is done without a third party. So you don't need a bank, an adjudicator, a court, a judge, or anybody else, or a referee. They can do business on a trust-free basis directly. 